Scott Engel of RotoExperts.com and Sirius XM Fantasy Sports Radio here with Wilson Chandler of the Knicks. Uh, Wilson, this team's generating a lot of si excitement again in New York. Uh, maybe they can make the playoffs for the first time in a few years. Uh, definitely, you know, uh, like you said, it's been a lot of excitement going around the city. You know, locker room, everything, everyone's ecstatic. So, you know, definitely happy for that. You know, just pumped to get the season started and see how uh, we, it make out. Raymond Felton coming over to the Knicks, <coughs> running an up-tempo game. Uh, I guess you guys are geared to have a lot of fun and scored a lot of points this year. Definitely, you know, Ray's a good point guard. You know, he's going to do a great job, you know, I, you know, I think. So, you know, I'm looking forward to playing with him, you know, and just see what happens. How much do you know about fantasy sports? Like if people come up to you and say, hey, man, I got you on my fantasy basketball team, do you find that flattering? Uh, definitely. You know, that's the, uh, that's the most I know about it, you know, from people, you know, telling me that. But uh, it's definitely flattering, you know, that they draft me. You know, they depend on me for the, uh, I guess, the, how they do the points. I don't know how they do the points, but, you know, for that. You so, know, you like know. Uh, multi-category, like, you know, right. steals, you know, Free stuff rounds, like yeah. that, three-pointers. Yeah, so it's definitely uh, it's, uh, good to hear, you know. Some of the NBA guys play fantasy football. You ever considered doing that? No, I never did it, but um, when Malik uh, Rose was here, he, he was a big fan of that, so he did it a lot. So uh, Amari Stoudemire coming over here, uh, it, it's a very friendly situation for him. You think he's going to fit in quickly and like put up a lot of big numbers right away? Definitely. You know, and, um, you know it's preseason. You know, obviously, preseason is the workout thing, but as soon as the season starts, you know, he's going to be himself like he played for D'Antoni you know, in his early, early years. So, you know, um, he's going to fit right in. Obviously, uh, I'm sure a question a lot of people asked you, your opinion on the big three in Miami. Um, I really don't have an opinion, you know, like, you know, that was his that okay. That was his decision. He made it. You know, I'm happy for him. You know, you know, like I said, it's his decision. You know, nobody's entitled to you know say anything about that. You know, you know, he's, he's earned it. You know, and I think you know, you know, people should just let it rest, and just let it play out. You know? More from a perspective, of like how exciting you know is that going to be when they come in, when you guys face <coughs> them. You know, it, it's it's going to be an electric atmosphere. Oh yeah, it's definitely going to be a good atmosphere. You know, like you know. I'm, I think it's a good thing for us, you know, just to test, you know, our toughness and where we're at as a team, you know, and to play against a team that's good like that, well, as far as talent-wise, you know. You know um, so it's definitely going to be a test for us. Good for a team like the Knicks, too, to play against somebody like that, right? Right. Yeah. Thanks a lot for the time. Appreciate, appreciate it. it. Thanks.